but you define uh, uh, some music that inspires you, that lifts you. Yes. Joe said there's a lifting in your spirit. Yes. You define some music that will lift your spirit, that will lift yes. your thoughts, lift your mind, yes. or can I say it like this, uh, that will create a sense of inspiration in you to the point you feel inspired. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes. These are tools that you can use because during the week and during the daytime, you may come in on Sundays and you may receive something. And you get inspired with that thought, praise God. But trust me, during the week, amen, you're going to be challenged. Circumstances are going to challenge you. Your yesterday is going to challenge you. Your past is going to challenge you. Sometimes some stupid stuff you don't even know is inside of you, you're going to rise up and challenge you. You don't forget all about the root cause of it, and now you're dealing with the symptom of it. You see what I'm saying? So you need to find these twos and then embrace these twos that will help you recenter, help you reprogram, help you refocus. I like something that uh, Patricia said the other day. She had a little sign over her door, praise God. When you come in our office, you know what I mean? Uh, hey, hey, got to go back outside. Come here being positive. You have to own that. You have to own that. Because people are people in your own mind will present things to you to bring you down. You have to stop your own mind from thinking some stuff. Oh, stop. Amen. No, 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 no. Your own mind, not just other people, but your own mind will challenge you. It will bring things to you, and it's up to you to say, stop. Wait, wait. Yes, yes. I only embrace positive thoughts. I said a while back every now and then, you got to summon your congregation together and look over your congregation. Your congregation are your thoughts. Mm -hmm. Amen. All of them, amen. Your good thoughts and your negative thoughts. Because you'd be surprised sometimes in the midst of your congregation, in the midst of your thoughts, there are some thoughts there that, that's been hiding out, that's been challenging you, that's been rising up trying to slay you, and, and, and you haven't yet identified it. you you got to uh, 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 search your deepest self. And find that thing deep in you that's been challenging, that's been aggravating you. Because, see, we can't move forward until you challenge those things. Until you correct those things. 